While new cars may be flashy and fun, many of us prefer to buy used when it comes to our cars, SUVs and trucks. But what do you need to know or at least keep in mind when buying a used vehicle? Well, let's ask our auto informer or at least our auto informer son. Just as good, David Moss. <laughs> David, how are you today? I'm doing great, how are you? I am well, thank you for coming in today. Yeah, thanks for having me. So, used cars. I know you've kind of got a mentality that a lot of people just want to shy away from used cars. Why is that? Well, you gotta, you gotta really understand why people buy premium vehicles most of the time is for budget reasons. I mean, let's just face it, not everyone can go in and buy a forty, fifty, sixty thousand dollars $60,000 car when they can buy a car that's 10 or 15 that accomplishes the same goal and has the same amount of space. So one of the things that I like to think of and, and my team likes to think of too is when someone's looking at a pre-owned vehicle, the biggest fear is buying somebody else's problem. Like what am I gonna get stuck with? Yes. I have no warranty, I have a car that I really don't know the track record and there's really cool, there's car facts and things like that yep. that give you a little bit of the history but the biggest fear would, would cross anybody's mind is, is what are the underlying problems that I, that I don't what know did we about? Miss? What, what did we, we miss, right? Yeah. yeah, I'm saving all this money but to what expense later on down the road. So one of the things to look at when you are buying a pre-owned vehicle, not only is just the history of that car, because there's no telling the history of a car. There really isn't. You gotta make sure a couple things, is the car safe? Safety is key. Does the yeah. car go? Does the car stop? Am I gonna have to replace tires? Look at some of the things that are gonna cost a little bit of money soon, sooner than later. I mean, buying four tires can be pretty expensive. But not only that, one of the most important things is looking at value of the vehicle. Buying a car is one part, but buying a car that you're not gonna have to spend a bunch of money on very soon down the road, that's the biggest, probably fear, that comes into anybody buying a pre-owned vehicle. Um, one of the things, and I don't wanna talk about us too much, but one of the things when you buy a pre-owned vehicle from Moss Nissan is we put on every single car, new used, it could be a $2,000 car or a $115,000 GTR, you get Moss Care which gives you a little bit of a maintenance agreement like we talked on our previous show, mm -hmm. is it, you are gonna have oil changes and tire rotations for the lifetime of that vehicle. So that's one thing you don't, you're not gonna have to pay don't for. You don't have to worry about that. Don't have to worry about that. You get a little engine warranty that's gonna cover the engine. Plus there's a lot of really cool things that we do to really make that car, the value of that car much higher and, and last a little longer. We, we, we do a paint protectant on the outside, we do an interior protectant on the inside. There's a lot of additional things we do. We put the VIN number of the car, we etch it into the glass of the windshield to prevent theft. There's so many little things that we do because we feel when you're buying a pre-owned vehicle, you should still get that cool experience mm -hmm. you get. You know, when you go buy a new car, you already assume you're gonna get a good experience. But yeah. when you buy a pre-owned car, you kind of assume, I'm gonna get a car, I'm gonna walk out of there and they're gonna just wave goodbye. But we don't want people to have that experience. We want people to have a great experience, no matter what they're buying. Well, I'm already feeling better because I was using the word used all the time. And David's like pre-owned. I like that oh, connotation did I say that? better already. <laughs> I like that better already. You're changing the connotation and, and changing the people way of, of thinking because I think it is a scary thing. Now, one of the things I want to ask, you always hear about, and I might mess this number up, but like the 30-point inspection. Mm -hmm. what, what is that? Is that part of the, the pre-owned cars that people definitely want to get when they're purchasing that pre-owned? Yeah, one of the biggest fears is a lot of people shy away from dealerships when they're looking at pre-owned cars and they'll go to these buy here pay here's and nothing against anybody's business but yeah. it's always a little bit of a uh, it's always a little bit of fear when you're buying a car from a place um, from a different place that's not a dealership because we're held to really high standards at a dealership we have to inspect a vehicle we have to put our stamp of approval saying a vehicle's safe and it's going to be a reliable car we have to put our stamp of approval on these vehicles so we do multi-point inspections in some cases up to a 160 plus different points that we have to touch and make sure is going to pass the regulations and the, and the guidelines and it's going to basically be a safe and reliable car for our customers. So yeah, we do inspect the cars very thoroughly to make sure that we don't want, we, our worst, our biggest fear as a, as a dealership is we would hate to sell you a vehicle and then you have problems with it down the road mm -hmm. because you're not going to think, oh, well, I bought a pre-owned car or used car. Mm -hmm. um, this is, I guess I should have just bought new. You're going to think, man, that dealership should have did a better job inspecting the car, no matter where you bought it from. So that's something that we take pride in is we really want to make sure that if we're going to deliver a car to a customer, they're not going to have any problems. Man, I thought it was only 30 point. He went up to over 100. I love it. <laughs> well, if you want more information on Moss Nissan from David Moss, feel free, to give, feel free to give him a call. Visit the website. All of the information is right there on your screen. As always, we appreciate that you are our auto informer.